<laughs> you must have found some amazing loot in your day. My greatest find was an elixir of eternal youth. What? But it came with a terrible cost. You have to take it twice every day. That doesn't seem so bad. This particular elixir is not to be taken orally. Oh dear. Okay. The mayor said you could help me get a new weapon. Help you? You must be pretty dang desperate to come to an old man for help. Don't you have an old weapon I could use? You want old Bessie? I couldn't possibly part with the old girl. Well, you do have an axe in the back. Can I just take that? Perhaps we can work out a trade for your sword, Bessie. A trade, you say? Well, there is something I want. In all of my adventures, one thing has always eluded me. The artifact? <laughs> the touch of a woman? The touch of a woman? I want... A tank! Huh? A tank? No, better yet. I want... A taco! Huh. Well, which do you want? A tank or a taco? Whatever, I'm not picky. <laughs> Against my better judgment, I'll get you that tank. Hot diggity! My very own tank! What does a geezer like you need a tank for anyway? The less you know, the less you can be charged with later. On second thought, you're getting a taco. Excellent! Get me one with pork, pinto beans, and a corn tortilla. Ooh, and make sure it's extra spicy. No one ever makes tacos spicy enough anymore. Bring me my taco, and I'll give you a sword. Well done. Oh, and you probably need this. <laughs> oh wow, one dollar. It's not like I can spare those ninety-five thousand dollars I have. Hmm. Ah, the whippersnapper. Where's my taco? Well, I didn't make the one he wanted. He wanted pork, corn tortilla, pinto beans, and spicy. I've got your taco. Hey, that's not what I asked for. I wanted pork, pork pinto, pinto beans, beans and, and a corn tortilla, and, and make it extra, extra spicy. spicy. Yes. I'd love to stay and chat, but I'd be lying. <laughs> Don't forget about my taco. No, sir. If a taco grants me a tank, I mean a weapon, then I guess I'll get you that taco. I just hope the lady can make it extra spicy. Also, I hope I did not use up my taco winning. Greetings, taco wench. <laughs> hmm. Welcome to Plunk Muckle Taqueria. How can I help you today? I just had the sudden, uncontrollable urge uh. to have another taco. The Surgeon General advises against it. Uh. But that'll be one dollar, please. Yeah, sure. Do you want beef, pork, chicken, or tripe? Hmm. Pork. Pork. Black, refried, pinto, or garbanzo beans? Gar. No, pinto. pinto. Corn, wheat, spinach, or low carb sawdust tortilla? Corn. Corn. Any special requests? Make it spicy! Can I make that extra spicy? Sorry, sir. We're not allowed to sell extra spicy tacos anymore. Plunk Muggle Taqueria had a bit of a lawsuit a couple years back, you see. Huh. Sad. Hmm, I have two tabo two tacos now. Anyways, I couldn't make it extra spicy. Let's hope he wants it. Ah, the whippersnapper. Where's my taco? I've got your taco. Hey, that's not what I asked for. I wanted pork, pint, and and a what? Oh. <laughs> you forgot to give me money to buy the taco. I did. How silly of me. Here you go. <laughs> awesome free cash. I don't forget. Blah. Okay. I have it, but I can't really make it extra spicy. Hmm, how do I make it extra spicy? I guess I need to find some spice of some sort. 
Maybe inside bongs. No, this looks more like a potion shop. Hello, Bong. Good day, semi-lucid potioner. The name's Bong. You don't say. Hmm. You know where I can get a new sword? Oh, you brick might be able to help you out. He lives just down the lane from here. Yeah, okay, I knew that. What's new, Bong? Oh, nothing. Aw. What's with all the questions? I'd like to do business with you. Take your time looking. Ooh, lots of lots of potions. Hmm, but nothing that makes spicy. Sad. To you, Bong, I say good day. Hmm, maybe nozzle forts. Greetings. What do No. Nothing here says spicy. How do I spice up my taco? Because, really, according to her, she won't do it. Well then, people, I guess I need to use one of these. For the color of weapons and all oh, right, special spicy. Want a special spicy taco? I think I saw a taco time man. Oh. Hint. Oop. Pay attention to the ingredients you ever wanted a taco. Yes. You need to find something to combine the taco to make it a spicy taco. Yes! Combine the taco with the hair of the pixies in your inventory to make it. How am I supp. <sighs> Fine. That wasn't very obvious, but. Okay. You bricks, taco! Ugh. Well, I used some of those. It was kind of the only thing I could do, but... Hey, now you now saw how they work. Those fortune cookies. I wonder how they work that way. Like, a fortune cookie is like, you know, they have control over the fate of reality in this world. Snapper. I have got your taco. I've got your taco. Now this is one fine taco. Thank you, young man. <laughs> Aren't you going to eat it? As soon as I remember where I put my teeth. Huh. All right. Let me see that broken sword of yours. Here you go, kid. A weapon. My sword is reborn. They shall now regale you with a dance of appreciation. No need to thank me with interpretive dance, young man. Aww. This taco is all the reward I need. And you enjoy that taco, you break the retired, and I'll see you around. Don't forget to go back to the mayor now that you got your new sword. There what? are orphans that need rescuing. Huh. Come see me again. I have need of some heroic services. Ooh. Eager to return to Lord Von Prong with the artifact in hand, Sergeant Orc wasted no time with protocol. Lord Von Prong, I have returned with the artifact. Lord Von Prong stared at the puzzling artifact. Its legend well known, but its purpose a complete mystery, and not the real reason he slapped the hero Deathspank. Why did he toss it? Lord Von Prong would ask. You did bring it to me as I instructed! Oh, how could Sergeant Orc have forgotten that one simple instruction? Was it the weight of its importance? Or maybe the heat of battle? Or maybe other dark forces were at work? 
but it matters not. The Lord Von Prong has little patience for those who cannot follow orders. Sergeant Orc begs for one last chance to kill Deathspank and return with his purple thong. But Lord Von Prong has another plan. A plan more cunning than the last. A plan that is sure to place the hero Deathspank's thong firmly in his grasp. Wait. Oh, yes! You look much more heroic now! What does a sword have to do with finding missing orphans, anyway? It's for the eventual photo op! Image matters! Here, take this bag. What's this bag for? You'll be needing it to carry the little bugger. Uh, what? Make sure to poke a few holes so they can breathe! <laughs> the bag of the orphans. <laughs> I'll leave that up to you. Oh, dear. Okay, okay, okay. Let's summarize here. Um, <laughs> apparently the thong that Spang wears makes him powerful in some way, and the French right that is the artifact has no value to Lord von Prong. Also, he looks like a gay vampire, so I'm gonna call him Edward from now on. <laughs> Zing. Anyways, I have a sword. Look at this, a fixed sword. Ubrick's crappy fix-it job sword. Anyways, it's still a weapon! And I'm gonna go get back my items. Stupid morons! Wait. If they're that easy to kill... What? Spank, you're gonna kill them with your bare hands! Oh, <laughs> oh my lord. Look at this. I got all my items back. <laughs> yes. None shall stand in my non existent way. Just gonna fix up this so everything checks out. Yes, okay. <laughs> yes, Deathspank is back. Deathspank got back. <laughs> I can finally kill barrels again. And chickens. Oh, how delightful.